Hey everybody, welcome back to a slice of gaming. I am the only Python for this is pretty. Can I really be the hero for the Sony PlayStation Portable? And this game is brought to you by GameNewLand.com. So the moment we've all been waiting for. Time to make the altar dessert at the Age Sage Altar. The flavor stage makes its home here on top of Towering Mountain Peak. Note to many as spice tea. You can turn any ingredient into the altar dessert. Without further ado, let's go. every known ingredient in the universe. I'm the cake mix master, the sour candy wrapper, the flavor sage spice tea. Yeah, yeah, we know all that. Can you just hurry up, dude? No time for a rhyme, my man. All right, <laughs> let's have a look. What's the verdict, dude? My heaven, these are fantastic! We can make the ultra dessert no problem! Yeah! What? That's it? It's just that easy? How boring! Come on, shake things up! Give these pretty pukes something to cry about! Is that what this is all about, dude? Almighty Robotic Kitchen Aid, Chef Bot 9000! 9000? Why does this thing exist? The road to flavor is long and winding. Be silent and observe. Now, let's shake, roll, and rattle. Time for a cooking battle! <laughs> cooking battle? Dude! Now we're talking! Good luck, dude! Introducing the game's most doing? aggravating boss because of one simple reason. Patience. That is something we all know that I don't have. Okay, first thing you might notice is yes, the Chef Bon 9000 is named after the Over 9000 meme. I should clear that up right now, otherwise I'm probably going to be getting comments saying, It's my Oh, oh look. I should probably pay attention and actually hit him. Okay, thing you might notice, number one, is that sometimes when you throw the bomb at him, it doesn't really register. You have a very, very fine window of where you can attack on this boss. And that window, well, that's going to be that little flame right in the middle. And be careful of the bombs, because they can be your worst enemy in this boss battle, because you can get injured by them. You can leave a scarf, because that's going to be totally ridiculous. And basically, the main aggravating reason behind this boss is that, well, the time. You only have three minutes to do this boss, and in those three minutes, well, you have to wait for him to supply you with the weapons. Obviously. Well, what else are you going to attack? The rock in the background that you can't even grab? No. You're just going to sit here, hope that your bomb hits him in that little tiny window that you got there, and hope you do it in time. Because, well, <laughs> yeah, this is not going to be the first attempt of pretty that we're going to waste here. I just want to tell you that we're right now. Unless, oh my god, by miracle, by miracle. Cannot Holy shit. <laughs> that was a miracle. That was a freaking miracle. <laughs> I am so ecstatic right now. It is awesome. The Ultra Dessert lives! <laughs> what a marvelous scent! See, so this is... Finally, dude! 
Wherever sweets are in danger, I shall be there! Has Sir Sweet, the overlord of flavor, arrived just in time? Um, are you asking me, dude? Oh, my! Absorb that enchanting aroma! I thought it might be the ultra dessert, and I think I thought right! <laughs> the ultra dessert is now in my hands now! <clears throat> If you really want this tasty snack treat, you better step up! Oh, what you bitch. The... That was Sir Sweet. He's a gourmet demon who's all about the sweet flavors. Sir Sweet, huh? Wait a second! He took our dessert, dude! He lives in a castle far across the Black Desert Desert. I gotta get it back or Master Etna will kill me! With lots of pain, dude! Be careful out there. That's desert pirate turf you're heading into. And by that, he means there's more to this game than meets the eye. Of course, just when we thought things would be over with an ending. No, that is never the case. Okay, something caught my eye at the very end here. Okay, I will say no for now, but I will come back to say, what is this guy you think doing? The dessert pirates are to blame for us disappearing, dude. I mean, they're pirates. They gotta be evil, dude. Are you trying to make me want to give up, dude? I like his desk. That was kind of interesting. That's why I kind of went over to him. But well, when I come back, let's go to the desert. So I will catch you guys later.